God is not the same today, uh, tomorrow, yesterday, because he's dealing with your issue. God has never changed. God does not change his ways, never. He is unchangeable. The new covenant didn't change God. It reconciled us to him. He is called ancient of days for a reason. He is Jehovah old school. He does not change. He made it easier for us to deal with him. But his operations are exactly the same. He doesn't change. So life is primarily spiritual. But the issue is our sight has been afflicted. And because our sight has been afflicted, we are not able to see. So if you cannot see, then you cannot walk. I, I don't know if you heard what I said. If you have no sight, then you cannot walk. The word vision simply means sight. The word vision simply means sight. So if I have no sight, the people what? Perish. Not plans for the future, sight. Now the issue is this. Now listen to this. God comes to Jeremiah and tells him, Jeremiah, what do you see? Now you have to understand that God never asks you, what are you looking at? There is a difference between looking and seeing. That's it. That's it. That's it. Hear me. Your physical eyes, you don't use them to see. You use them to look. But you use your spirit to see. I feel like I'm in the wrong place. Maybe I should go to overflow. I think next week I'm starting on the overflow because you guys are too calm for me. Come to the overflow, prophet. Hear me by the spirit of God. There is a difference between looking and seeing. The Bible says, see what the Lord has done, not look. Yes. The reason why many of us can never enter into what God has ordained is because we are looking but we are not seeing. Uh, let, let me go a little bit deeper. You are looking but you cannot see. To look, I received that. Reba Shadabahaya. Listen to me. To see and to look, completely two different things. Let me give you an example. Jesus goes into his hometown. He preaches a good word that will bring deliverance to people. But when they looked at him, they said, is he not Joseph's son? We saw him growing up in this neighborhood. We saw him here. Now he thinks he's so deep. <laughs> but when Mary Magdalene saw him, she saw salvation. She went to cry and plead for her sins. When the Pharisees saw him, they saw a wizard. But when the young men who heard Jesus was in town, they put their friend on a bed, went and took off the roof and lowered him to Jesus. What they saw. The teaching. Your dealing with God is because of how you see, not because of what you look at. <laughs> 